Have you seen Quinn? Quinn, where are you? Look up, Max. I'm right here. <sighs> Quinn, I don't know where here is. In the top of the tree, Max, I can see your little brown ears and your cute black nose. And I can see Mr Fox on the top of his ladder. Jill next door has fallen off her bike. And Grandma Gwen is giving a tired bee some honey. You can see all of that from up there. I'm being a giraffe today, Max. Have you ever wanted to be a giraffe? You look like a monkey, Quinn, not a giraffe. Giraffes don't climb trees. Have you seen my legs, Max? Have you seen my neck? Of course I'm not a giraffe, but I wanted to see what it was like to be as tall as a giraffe. And giraffes are taller than trees. So this is me being a giraffe. Well, Quinn the giraffe, I want to be a giraffe too. Wow, you can see a long way when you're a giraffe. How fantastic, Quinn. I feel like I can see the world. Is this how giraffes feel? Like they can see the world too? If I really was a giraffe, Max, I could see everything at once. Imagine seeing your friends and their friends and your family and your teachers and everyone that was important to you. Have you looked at a giraffe's eye, Quinn? A giraffe has beautiful big eyes. And a giraffe can see its feet, its family and friends. And it can see right to the horizon where the sky meets the earth. What big ears they have, Max. If I had ears like that, I could hear everything. Scientists have discovered that giraffes can hear infrasound. Sound so low that human ears can't hear it. Scientists have heard giraffes humming at night. They believe this is their way of communicating with each other. Their big heart, the biggest of all land animals, is just right for their long legs and long neck. Could we be like giraffes with big hearts, great eyesight and fantastic ears for hearing? If we think like a giraffe, then we can think more kindly about each other. Could we be better friends, Max? Do you mean use our eyes to have a look at our friends and notice? Yes, notice, Max. Notice when they need us to pay attention. Or notice when you're hanging upside down. Yes, Max. Notice when you're doing something out of the ordinary and need a friend. A friend with a big heart like a giraffe and big ears to listen. Not just big ears, Quinn. Kind ears and kind thoughts. Thoughts like... My friend looks sad. I wonder if she needs a hug. I think I'll ask her. I wonder what my friend would like to tell me. I wonder what my friend would like me to know. I get it, Max. Sometimes I want you to know that I'm tired or that I just woke up feeling grumpy. And that just because you're quiet, you're not a mean friend. You just want some time to do some thinking. That's right, Max. Sometimes my head's just busy. And sometimes I really need a friend to know that I'm scared or worried or frightened. You need a friend to look at your grumpy face and think, what would Quinn like me to know and I need a friend to look at me and think I know what you need Max you need a friend to think what's going on with Max I need to go and talk to him 
What is going on with you, Max? I'm wondering how children will feel when they choose to behave like a giraffe. thoughtful, understanding, kind, generous. Someone said M something. I think you mean empathy, Quinn. Empathy is a really big word, Max. When you have empathy, you understand how someone feels and you think kind thoughts about them. And do kind things? Choosing to be kind is showing someone that you do have empathy. How do you feel after you choose to think like a giraffe? the children say that they felt kind, like a good friend, and they were glad they listened. They were proud of themselves, and they could understand how their friends felt. What happens to friendships when you choose to be a giraffe? That's easy, Max. Friendships are easier. You have more friends. Your friends trust you because they know your heart is big and kind. Big enough to listen, Quinn. Big enough to connect. When we are connected to our friends, we are our happiest. I'm going to be a giraffe. What would my friend like me to know? I'd like you to know, Quinn, that I'm glad you're my friend. That's exactly how I feel, Max. I'm glad we're giraffes. Mm -hmm. 